No. Uh uh. No. Y'all aren't. See? Yep. Here we go. Yep. So where are you hiding the eggs? Tell me where you're hiding the eggs. Where y'all hiding them? We have an egg. Where are they at? Mm hmm. Uh uh. Nope. Is that nope. all we have is the three, though? Yeah, we got three, but that's not bad considering the fact one of the board, uh, barred rocks were laying the eggs in the mudroom. What's up, y'all? Welcome to the vlog. Uh, wow, everybody's just going off today, aren't they? Well, I don't have much that I can do because the sun's going down. But most of y'all know... Hey! I just got home. Calm down. Good Lord. Anyways, but there's two things that I need to get done. Well, there's one thing I need to get done. I don't think the other one's going to be possible today. But uh, worked a little overtime today. So, sun's almost down. I need to get Lapua a little shelter right here. Now that the, yeah, the wet season's coming. Oh, Chelsea. I thought it was a deer at first because all I saw was a flicker and it was her tail. She's hiding right underneath there. No, Look. she came, she was all the way back Yeah, there. she was right there when I first saw her. I no. Know. No. No. We're not dealing with that right now. I got you on camera too acting a fool, I think. If anything, everybody heard the chicky doos. But yeah, I first saw her like right here and all you could see was her tail swooshing. And I thought it was a deer at first. I'm just glad she's going back there and finding stuff. Well, that's good. Hey, look how lazy he is. Look. Who, him? Look. Is he eating laying down? Yep. Uh, I guess that is a little. He, he kind of rolls around. You know what that means. Time for him to eat. Time to put him in the freezer. Eat, eat. Anyways, yeah, we need to figure out something. And I'm not going to sit there and make it too special right now because I plan on adding... A section right here that Lapua could come into to get away from the weather, especially since winter's coming. But uh, I'm just going to stack up some pallets and then grab one of my roofing panels and throw it on top. I tried blocking the weather from him with a piece of plywood and a pallet up against a tree, and he annihilated it. So, yeah. I know, they are loud. Look, even she's sitting there in the background going, mm mm. Did you touch it again? No, it's funny. Yeah, it's completely funny because they touch it every day at least five times. Do they what? Yeah, I let them out. Because I know for a fact they're going to go back to that coop. But, but that's what I was saying. Like, I wish they can stop going to that coop and come over here, but can't blame them. They've gone to that coop for almost three years now, so... Some of them, almost four, or no, no, we don't have any more left from our old flock, so, but yeah, almost three years going to the sun coop, like, I got frustrated when I put them in here, and then the first night, I let them out after, I lock them in here for, I don't know, what, two months, two months I locked them in here, and the first night lock, uh, opened up the door, or the first day, they went straight over there that evening, so just something I'm going to have to deal with. So I know, she is lonely. Probably not. She's going to run. She's going to run. <laughs> that's not what she sounds like. No, that's not a quack, Lapua. That is not a quack. That is far from a quack. Uh, But yeah, anyways, yeah. I'm going to stack some pallets right here. Take one of my pieces of roofing. Boom. Run it across. That way he could get out of the weather. It'll give him an opportunity to just get a break from the weather even though i know he can handle it it's still that mindset of you know just like all of us we don't want to deal with some things sometimes so all right wow i think that how soggy are you it's slippery it's fairly firm though ew but that ain't bad for uh, the next day. The water looks fairly clean. Not too shabby. That's good. And I saw, as you can see, a couple of, like most of the birds roosted here. And that's what I wanted to do was try to get most of the younger birds in here. Oh, it stinks. It doesn't stink in here. Your nose is broken, honey. 
My nose is not broken. I'm sticking here. Can you see my pants today? Do what? Trying to make sure. No, you still look like you're not wearing pants. It's okay though. Anyways, I purposely. No. I. Seriously? No. 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 You know what? You will be the motivation for daily vlogs. That way I can show everybody how it... it I, I, don't you dare. We told you no on this flock. That flock doesn't mean any different. You are now motivation for daily vlogs. What can we do with Lapua in 18 months? Golly. And what's funny is I watch other vloggers. They just bought Great Pyrenees Pup. Uh, like Kendall Gray. His Great Pyrenees Puppy? Has he had even tried... Well, his is... Steve's not that old yet to start killing anything right now. I mean, but he shows that he wants to work. And then Chelsea said that she's fought the chickens getting in the mudroom all day long. I don't even know why they keep on going to the mudroom. Because the food that has fallen in between the cracks. The food that fell in the between the cracks? Yeah. The ones that... Well, then we'll just go get some flooring and... All right. So, step one. Get some pallets. Stack it up to the same height as the IBC container. Yeah. For why? For why? Did you not listen? How were you beside me the whole time? You said, but what is stacking them going to do? Well, if I stack the pallets up at the same level as the IBC yeah. container. Oh, and just put like a board on top? Well, I was going to take one of my roofing pieces and just put it on top. But the pallets that I'm putting over there are the same pallets that I'm going to be using for the wall on that section of the barn. <laughs> Poor duck's just sitting there like, I didn't do anything. <laughs> well, then go on Craigslist, see if you can find her a mate. Buddy, friend. What if she doesn't like him? Doesn't like him? I don't think nature works that way. <laughs> Chili and Felipe are both males. That's nature and humans. Well, not technically. It depends on the situation. Clearly, both of them do not like the same sports team. Oh my goodness! Yeah, the cheat! Which one's the first? Oh, I guess that one. This one, the cheat. And they all claimed my little bench I made. Oh, yeah. I made another bench. <laughs> well, actually, I made two. I made another swing chair identical to that one. And then I made a double seater. This one? Is this, which one is it? Hold on. Let me see your faces. Let me see your faces. They all look the same to me. No. This one is terrified. So is that I what can, you named it? No. Like, it's it's skittish. I can be, I'll be outside, and all three, these three will come running to me. This one, mm-mm, he goes and hides. Or she, whatever it is. I don't know. I haven't checked their genitalia yet. The genitalia? Say junk, it's just funny. What are you doing? A girl. Oh my gosh, did we get all girls? That's a girl. Oh, good lord. Hold on. That's a girl. Oh, well, we're going to have to make a trip to the vet for the first time. And we got a boy! Hey! Yeah, I don't want to end up on that one show, like Hoarders or whatever the one is, that like has the 80 million rats. Yeah, yeah no. No. Three girls, one boy. And Ghost is a girl. Well, we know Ghost is a girl. And she does not like it. That's, that's your mom! She doesn't like her. I hope the audio actually picked that up. She just growled. She, like <laughs> she almost bit your arm at first until she realized who it was. She like the babies either. Really? Well, don't do that. <laughs> oh, what? Don't do that. I, she needs to love them. Oh. Are she menstruating? What's that? Hey, can you switch your hand? That looks really bad. <laughs> <laughs> it really looked like you were strangling the cat at first. <laughs> oh, she's still a baby. She just I, I'd say at least another six months before any of that happens. Yeah, but then like again, it's nature. 
All right, well, now I'm going to go try to get some work done. Well, that ain't much of work, but... Keep you I am entertained. You can but hold I the... Don't want to work. But then don't work. How about this? Hold the camera. I'll oh, stack up the work. pallets. That's not... Holding the camera's work? You need to edit a video. No, I already told you what I would do if I was in charge of editing. What would you do? Just slap all the frames together. Okay. That is all right. <laughs> oh lord all right <laughs> okay oh yeah i just gotta get these i don't now now i'm i know i'm stacking top now i'm gonna use the nice ones i'm gonna use the nice ones because i know for a fact they're all the same size yeah they're all the same do what he's not gonna ruin them he can't ruin them if they're stacked up as the height of the I IBC, what are you doing? Your ears are dirty. <sighs> no, I didn't clean my ears this morning. Oh, I can tell. All these pallets, well, these three and all these are the same exact size, same exact age. I feel like using these would be the best for the walls of what I'm doing. And then what I plan on doing is whatever pallets I'm going to get the slabs and then fit them in between and they'll finish off the walls. It's like already a quarter of a wall framed. All you gotta do is like screw them together. Anyways, all right, let's get to work. Well, besides you apparently. Hold on, <laughs> hold on, hold on, wait, hold on. I gotta build a, <laughs> so I'm sitting here working on moving the pallets and Chelsea goes, you want to know, what, what did you say, what's interesting about living with boys or whatever? And she comes up with... <laughs> just handed it to me. Did he just do that now? Oh no, tell me. <laughs> why, did, why did he at least he just go outside? And he's so excited, he said, I pee in cup. <laughs> and I was like, why? The bathroom's right there. Up, he cup, and then hands it to me. Might be going through his head right now. <laughs> no. Oh, shit. Did he go after it? Yes. But I don't. I don't want. Ooh. Ooh. I don't want it. I didn't want it either. Here, Lafour. <laughs> I don't want this. Yo. All right. I think I have enough pallets stacked up to meet with the IBC container. And I was also nice enough since you knocked out half of my ducks. No, 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 no. You knocked out half of my ducks and a quarter of my chickens. And I was nice enough to get you a nice firm pallet. And the slats are narrow so your feet don't fall in between. No, to get you off the ground. No, and I got you water. No. You know you're still a good dog, right? And that's why you're still here. All right, so I have to find a roof piece. What are they called? I, I had a brain fart earlier talking to Chelsea about it. Sheet metal, boom, there we go. <laughs> Tin roofing, hey, gotta figure out one. Not too big, not too short either. That'll reach across the, hey, I think I'm actually the top one I'm looking at. Ah, this got snake gritting all over it. Oh, that actually hurt. Really? Really? The one random screw. The one random screw. Why is there even a screw in a milk crate? Hey, it make no sense. See if we can get to that tin roofing without you know, chopping off a hand or something. This is a sign that I worked a lot of overtime for the past two years. This is all nice, flat, pretty sure it was all dirt. All right, this piece right here is what I'm looking at. Because I'm thinking, Ivy Key, uh, <laughs> Ivy Key, Ivy Key, no. It's a sister store to Ikea. <laughs> thinking, Ivy C container, little gap, pallets. So that might actually be the perfect length what I'm looking for. Is there just one or two? And is there gonna be a snake that's gonna lash out at my... Nope. No snakes. Good. All right, let's take this over there. Well, she's not the prettiest thing I built. Huh. 
I mean, it ain't the best, but it'll keep them out of the weather, off the ground. We got a couple storms coming in the next couple days. And those of y'all concerned going, well, that metal's gonna fly away. The pallets are gonna fall on him. We keep close eye of the weather, so if we see anything of hard winds or tornadic weather, he doesn't get left outside. He actually gets his butt dragged to the house and he gets put into the mud room. So, I said I'll be fine. He'll get him out of the weather, get him out of the rain. She'll do. All I need is just a couple days because I, I worked overtime today, meaning there's probably going to be overtime tomorrow and the next day and the next day into the weekend. And if I don't work the weekend, then I'm going to go ahead and actually extend this part and then he'll be able to come in and out of here. And then I'll still keep the the flooring. I'll either keep the flooring or give him a pallet where he can get onto and stay dry. And then I'll also make him a little section where he'll have bedding that he can lay into. Just in case, because I mean, he is not supposed to be chained up 24 seven for the rest of his life. His job is to secure the perimeters and help protect the, the farm. But I apparently got one of those great Pyrenees that decides that he'll do his job on the larger livestock, but with the smaller livestock, he's going to use it for supper. I mean, look at that face. That's a killer right there. You killed your mama's ducks, Lapua. Well, like I said, it ain't the prettiest. It ain't the best, but I'm sure he's not going to complain too much being off the ground, winds blocking where he needs to get away, and a roof blocking from whatever rain hits, drops, 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 rain drops. How you doing, girl? Doing good? You doing good? Are oh, you okay? I know, I know you okay. You like that water? I'm surprised yours is still clean too. All right, girl, I know. I'm sorry, I haven't taken you out in weeks and weeks. Oh. Took the wife's minivan. Ah, oh, damn, Parker in her spot. Well, darn. Well, instead of walking, I'll just drive there. I hope there's no chicken under the truck. I had to drive Chelsea's van to work today because she was on empty. I went to move her van out of the way so I could pull out the truck and I noticed it was on empty and I'm like, well, let me go ahead and put some fuel in here. Hey, Bubba, what are you doing? I heard you peed in a bottle. Was it fun? Yeah. <laughs> it was fun? What are you doing? Yeah. Are you going to ride with Daddy to move the van? Hey, right, sit back. It's your life. No pun intended. Oh, see, that's a joke. Just sit down. Don't move. I need keys. Hold on, I'll be right back. Keys, keys, keys. Where are the keys? keys. I got Bo. Uh, what, He's, you know now what, he did? what did he do? Did he poop on our eggs? No, there's things floating all in the water. He grabbed the the one that was sitting in the Dutch oven. So oh my goodness. Used it to stir the eggs. Oh, that's great. Are the eggs like They're still in the, the shell? shell? Oh, we're good then. Life of being with a three-year-old. Gotta love it. All right, Bo, you ready? You ready to go on an adventure? Yeah. No, that's your mom's snacks. You don't want to eat your mom's snacks. Show it. No, I wouldn't do that either. No, I wouldn't do it. Oh, you broke it. And I heard you used the spatula from the Dutch oven to stir the eggs. I don't know why you're stirring the eggs, but whatever. Yeah. Yeah. Great conversation. Yeah, we're not going very far, Bo, but still sit back because kissing the dashboard at two miles an hour or 70 still, still not fun. Uh, or just at the... Oh, you see the chicken on the backup camera. Yeah. <laughs> at, look, look how smart the chicken is. It's going to go under the van. I know. 
They're so smart, aren't they? Hey. Hopefully your mom could get out of this spot in the morning. Actually, actually I should disconnect the boat since I don't need it tomorrow. Around this time of year, I'll have the boat. Hey, you know what? After I heard what you've done in the last 10 minutes, I'm taking these keys with me, all right, mister? And don't touch anything. But this time of year, close to deer season, I'll have my boat with me most of the time. But since I don't need it tomorrow, I'll disconnect it, move forward, and then move her behind me so she'll still be able to get out of the driveway. After yesterday's storm, or rain, it wasn't much of a storm, just whatever. After it rained for pretty much 24 hours straight, Everything's soggy, so that's the last thing I need is that van sitting in a soggy spot. And when she wakes up in the morning to take Ray to her one-year doctor appointment, she can't get out. Ah, uh, where's my chalk? Uh, that'll work. Where's Bo? Bo? All right, stay right there. Never know what the three-year-old chickens go under the vehicles. Kids will run out in front of them. Like the chicken. Chicken, get out of the way. And then this. Now I got proof that they're on my porch. Get off my porch. Get off. There's nothing up there. Get off my porch. Shoo. Shoo. There's not, no food, no nothing. You know what, Bo? I forgot the key. Oh, never mind. They're right here. The what? No key. No key? Uh, no key. I, no, what? Uh, no key. Uh, there. Must be some foreign language. A no key. A no key. No key. Ah, no key. No key. All right, there you go. Mommy's back on solid ground. She won't get stuck. <laughs> and the rooster can still crow. All right, bud, come on. We gotta go. We're done. That's all we got to do today. Come on, Mo. Alright, well, you stay right there. I'm gonna move the truck. The, the sun's going down, Felipe. Down. Alright. Vehicles are moved, ready for the morning. Dog is covered, blocked from any mild storms. And Bo is still stuck in the van. Get out! Did you just lock the door? Bo, unlock the door. Get out. Pull that on me. You're not so smart because I knew you were going to do that. I left my door open. Didn't see that side, did you? Bo, no. Come here, now. Come on. We got to eat supper. And I'm done, Bo. Ooh, Bo. Come on. Bo, get out of the van. Well, fine. Spend the night in here. I don't care. Van's comfortable enough to do it anyways. <laughs> he just yelled, no. <laughs> Y'all, I know it wasn't much of a vlog today, but those of y'all having a bad day, I hope that me and my family were able to put a smile on your face today. Y'all, thanks for watching the vlog. I love each and every one of y'all. God bless.